Hello, this is Red Wizard 52, and this is a relaxing let's play of Warhammer 40k Dawn of War 2, episode 11. And we're doing the standard campaign. Our uh, commander Vlad is orbiting Calderas. He's uh, level seven. We have some uh, horrible stuff happening on Calderas. We now have uh, five pips towards the uh, Tyranid infestation. I guess. It says, represents the degree to which the Tyranid invasion has affected the planet. Complete Tyranid missions and hold strategic assets on this planet to lower it. So yeah, they're coming in, the like spore um, cloud is uh, infiltrating this planet. And um, so it's 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So we're 25%... Um, into a horrible Tyranid invasion. So hopefully we can do something about that. But we actually have to go to the planet of Meridian. Um, you know, we have to leave this planet and do something on the planet of Meridian. I'm not completely sure what we have to do. I have to check in on that. But first we need to level. So, uh, actually I want to start with Vlad because we got some new equipment. I want to see if we got any uh, good new equipment. He needs 300 and... Uh, 86 in order to level so yeah I don't think we're gonna get him to level this time but we are starting to get a lot of equipment what's this laurels of Hadrian level 5 I mean level 7 iron halo we got this um crown of iron it's a level 8 iron halo plus 14 armor plus 11 percent ranged damage resistance that's pretty good Though scoured by flame and chipped by constant gunfire, this flawless craftsmanship, uh, I'm sorry, the flawless craftsmanship of this iron halo keeps its protective power strong. Okay. So let's see, starting with weapons. We got this gauntlet of blood fist, level seven, level six, level six, level six, level six. Do we have anything level seven? Do we pick up anything? Solwart companion, this might be our replacement. Does 11.5 to the Herald of the Coming Dooms, 11.4. Um, plus one stamina, combat discipline, and plus one energy regeneration. Um, the description is, uh, only death may separate me from my sidearm. Oh my gosh. I think that's a, um, an RA reference. Uh, so, um, let's see. 11.4. Four. It looks like it's um, but the stalwart companion is um, commensurate with the herald of the coming doom, and the herald of the coming doom, even though it's level four, versus this is uh, level seven, it gives better bonuses plus two melee score, versus this one's um, energy regeneration. So I guess. I'm gonna stick with the Star Wars companion. Can I do two melee weapons? No, can't. We're gonna keep this gauntlet. Level five chainsword, plasma gun, bolter. This axe is still really cool. Level six armor. What's this? Level five armor. Uh, level five armor. Ooh, what's this? Level, oh, I've already equipped that. Level four armor, probably. Need to donate this now. How much is it going to give me? 289 becomes 328. So that was 11, uh, 31, 39 for that. Okay. I don't know. I still don't know how that's that's generated. I'd have to have 10 of those in order to level him up, and I I might be able to do that. But especially if I start do, um, donating some other stuff. Um. So yeah, I think that's it. No armor. I still want to keep this plus 10 armor rating. And this battle standard, the, the rally ability, the health, and then the defense against melee attacks, I um, mean recovery of health if he gets hit by melee attacks. is uh, Actually, it's just recovery from health if he gets hit by melee attacks. That's worth it to me. Okay, moving on. So he needs 600 to level. Don't know if that... Oh, he's already leveled, that's why. So... What should I do? I could get to that. I think I'm going to get that. Uh, focus fire extends weapon range. I think I'm going to do that. 
Or maybe I should um, be a little bit more balanced and do... Because he was getting taken out a lot, I think. Hmm. Let me think about this. Decisions, decisions. I'm compelled to be a little balanced. I want the one health because they're I, I can't just focus on ranged and I'll get that when he levels next but how about this um crazy unerring thunderbolt level 7 missile launcher can be usable by um, only avatus okay it's 100% versus everything attack speed is very slow but we're gonna do it because that's awesome yep we're doing it Level 4 Scourge of Xenos. Level 5. 6.6 .6 for this um, Chant of Resolve. And 6. Point, I think we're still going to keep the Scourge of Xenos. I don't know about this level 6 Bolter. I'm thinking I should just donate that. I'm going to hold off. Um, armor, level 5. Armor 16. Level 5. 16. Melee skill, don't need that. Um, level 5. Uh, incre each killed enemy increases all damage taken by nearby orcs by 15%. That might be good if I know I'm facing orcs, but I'm not sure what I'm facing over there on Meridian. Here, I'm going to just go ahead and check. This is probably in a good... We're going to go ahead and go to Meridian and see what I need to do. Because it's not going to make me, um, you know, launch the mission before I can work on my squad so I'm just gonna go there and see what we're facing this is uh, the capital world of sub sector Aurelia so hive world Meridian features huge city spires rising from urban landscapes the size of continents Angel Forge its ancient manufactorium produces everything from household goods to lace guns and aircraft so it makes slinkies and ICBMs that's a great manufactorium okay let's go to uh, we have this um, threat to Angel 4. There's an active distress signal. You must travel to the selected planet in order to deploy. All right, let's go to Meridian and see what's going on there. Meridian stands at the very heart of subsector Aurelia. 32 billion. Billions call its cities home. Its factories and forges are keys to victory against the Tyranids. We must not allow Meridian to fall. Okay, slow mo, badass walk. It's a trope in Warhammer 40k. Commander, welcome to Meridian Orbit. My name is Elena de Rosa. Governor Vandis has assigned me to be your liaison while in system. This is not the hinterlands of Calderas or Typhon, Commander, so a certain amount of discretion would be appreciated. It is imperative that we secure access to Angel Forge, Administrator DeRosa. Yes, so your Captain Angelos has said. Angel Forge is the most important manufacturing facility in the sector, however. Its use follows a strict schedule set by Governor Vandis and his Privy Council years in advance. Nevertheless, there may be a way to arrange special access to Angel Forge. Meridian has recently come under repeated attack from Eldar Raiders. They have already inflicted substantial damage to parts of our communication and supply infrastructure. The Imperial Guard forces stationed on Meridian are already tied down, suppressing food riots in the lower city. They do not have the manpower to deal with the Eldar as well. Were you to employ your special expertise in such matters and repel these raids, Governor Vandis believes he could arrange limited access to Angel Forge. Eldar sightings will be transmitted to your planetary display. DeRosa out. Commander, 
I left Meridian decades ago, but this is typical behavior. The nobility has always closed its eyes to problems in the Undercity. The Eldar must have raided wealthy spires for the noble houses to even acknowledge a problem. They will acknowledge it when the sky darkens with tyranid spores and hive ships. On that subject, Commander, initial scans indicate no tyranid activity whatsoever on Meridian. No activity at all. No mutated plants or slaughtered wildlife. No atmosphere or changes. None that we can detect. Check your sensors again, Martellus. Hive fleets do not ignore worlds in their paths. Cyrus is so, so wise. <laughs> he has that um, Batman voice that makes everything he says seem more important. Um, all right, so what was I doing? It's leveling up Avatus. I put the point. No, I, I, I leveled up Avatus, and now I'm leveling up Theth. Oh no, I was figuring out what what uh, armor to equip on Avatus. And I was going to do this armor of purgation, but there's no orcs on this planet, so we're just going to keep him with this armor of the destroyer. Superior power armor. Superior power armor. I got my eye on this armor to donate it. Male of zeal. Level four. Maybe going to donate that too. Okay, with three suits of superior power armor, we're going to donate those. Okay. And then any accessories I want to change up. These seem like they're really important. Maybe they're not that important. And this is why, because now I have this. Rally ability. And this would kind of make the stim packs redundant. And I've done a mission without these stim packs. And it's been fine. So let me think. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try to get rid of these um, stim packs. This might be a stupid idea, but these melt the bombs. Does it say what I'm going to? I'm, I'll finish my thought, but does it say what I'm gonna face here? Let me see. Commander, the Eldar seem intent on crippling Meridian's infrastructure. They have just silenced a major communications array used by Meridian's noble houses. Valuable items were also pilfered from nearby storage vaults. A powerful Eldar hover tank is leading these attacks, and the Imperial Guard has thus far been unable to stop it. If these raids continue, planetary defenses could be seriously compromised. And we're gonna get a superior combat shotgun. So that's all I needed to know. So these melt -a bombs Where are they at? melt -a bombs melt -a bombs melt -a bombs our anti-vehicle, so we're gonna equip that. Okay, we're, so we're set for this hover tank. Okay, hopefully that's not a mistake. Don't know if these are worth it. These seem really good, these um tarantulas. I'm gonna do that. I don't really use these all that much anymore. We'll see, I changed my mind. Okay, so we need Level 6 superior um, bolt pistol in this snarl of the wolf. Do I think they can't use this axe? Why can't they use the axe? They need two, no, they need three more points to use the axe. Okay, I'm gonna do one point here, and then when they level, they'll be able to use the axe, and one point in health. But in the meantime, this level 7 bolt pistol, stalwart. Companion. What is um stamina, combat, discipline? I don't see that listed here. It says plus one to stamina, combat, discipline. Maybe that's um the uh, number that uh, determines if they get suppressed or not. I don't know. I don't see it down here. Then their armor. They have level 6 power armor, 18. Nope. None of this is really important. So this level 6 superior bolt pistol, how much is that going to give me? 23 becomes 47. So that gave me um, 24. Okay. Cyrus. 
Level 3 shotgun. This level 6 superior boulder, I don't think so. I'm going to keep this um, death touch of the angel. Level 5 sniper rifle. This level 4 sniper rifle um, can probably be donated. Okay. 2096 becomes. Oh, okay. 4, 34, 39. Nice. So, of course, we're going to do this because they're our um, ranged person. Flamer. Okay, he can equip fl um, flamethrowers, which I haven't even got one yet. Um, more health. So I keep going down. He goes down real fast. His armor rating's really slow. I have this, which gives plus 10 armor rating. Is it called? It can, be, it can be used by all sorts of people. So what if I do this? I know 28 armor is really good for Vlad, but... That will bring him up to 20. I think he needs that. He's been going down way too fast. I don't like getting rid of this... Uh, um, Signum, the signal. Sophisticated targeting device, which allows uh, precision strikes from Imperial Guard. I need to... What if I, so I could just do this. It makes sense that the commander would be calling it. Oh, can I do two of these? Oh, he can only have one of those equipped at any given time. Say, force commander item, okay. Maybe I should do that. I hate to say it. It's going to take away that. What's this? Okay. By draining energy. But that means I'm going to need the healing again. Who can bring the um, stim kits? Overthinking this. Well, not really. I'm going to do this. Okay. So we got rid of the rallying skill. But we took his armor up to... Um, I have an idea. No, let's put this. This can be used by the force commander, right? So, force commander, and then you. Yeah, why not? Do that. Cyrus is fine here. We still want this plus ten. So, sixteen armor, eighteen armor, twenty armor, thirty-one armor, sixteen armor. 20, 22, 21, 35, 20, um, 100, 20, 100. Okay, so Tarkus is coming this time. I have to remember that. So Tarkus, you take this, uh, I haven't used those yet. I'm not going to worry about these, um, um, this airstrike thing. Even though it's really cool, I'm going to pass on it for now. i got to choose some points for him, so... Range, of course. Hmm. And health. Okay. So do I have enough to get Vlad up to... Okay, let's just start donating stuff. We have way too much. Superior bolt pistol. We don't need it. Plasma gun. We don't need it. Superior Bolter. Don't need it. Plasma Gun. I hope I'm not going to regret this. We don't need it. Oh, so we have uh, 180 more to go. Are we going to make it? Superior Power Armor. Don't need it. Superior Power Armor. Don't need it. Don't need it. Man, just a little bit more. Just like 110. Level four, don't need it. Hmm. 
Any of these accessories? This is not very... Doesn't Don't, don't really need that. Um, we could do it. We just got a couple more. What could I get rid of? What could I get rid of? Everybody has really good armor, right? Yeah, everybody has good armor, so... I'm just gonna get rid of this armor. Alright, that's all I need to do for now. Level up my force commander. Melee again. And a little bit more health. Okay. So we're gonna change this out. Who should I get rid of? Who has the most? 26, 75, 24, 14, 25, 70, 24, 19. So Thaddeus has to go. Uh, Thaddeus, you have to go. And Tarkus, you're coming. Just make sure that Thaddeus doesn't have anything I need. No. Okay, let's do this now. Okay. The Blood Ravens are a chapter of Space Marines that are based in the Imperium's eastern frontier. Like all Space Marines, the Blood Ravens are genetically modified warriors with superhuman endurance, reflexes, and mental capacity. They don't seem like they have high mental capacity in the uh, way they're presented in this game. They seem kind of um, thick skulled. Uh, their power armor, I, I know, if you read the Horus Heresy novels, they're actually really intelligent and thoughtful and kind of like heroic. And so far in this game, they seem kind of, um, I don't know, like, uh, I don't know, not very smart. But who knows, maybe it's just uh, the writing. Their power armor allows them to shrug off punishment that would destroy most tanks. The Blood Ravens are unique because they have lost all knowledge of their origins. Their records only date back to the Great Civil War that almost destroyed the Imperium millennia ago. They do not even recall their founder and simply refer to him as... Uh, the unknown Primarch. I thought it was uh, um, Sanguinius was their Primarch. Hmm. The Blood Ravens also have an unusual number of psychers, psionically gifted individuals, causing some to accuse them of having the taint of mutation and corrupted implants. It's not very nice. Oh, this rain again. Dang it. Stay alert. The Eldar strike without warning. Okay, destroy enemy generators. Where am I at? Do I want the communications array or the um shrine? Probably the shrine. I already have one communications array. So let's go this this way. Let's go. Cyrus, you demoed to play. Oh, that rocket launch is awesome. I don't know if you uh, saw the effect of the rocket launcher was uh, quite dramatic. Alright. Enemy troops destroyed. Enemy troops destroyed. So we want this um, communications array right there. Just want to make sure I'm not forgetting any tactical items. Okay, let's go. Flawed. Charge down. Have a Flash bombs do. Well, uh, I'm not gonna do a flash bomb. Ah. Alright, everybody gets has to get down here. Get down here. Eliminate those Eldar before they slip away. Get him, get him. Okay, let's do the halo and vulnerability. That's a pretty cool ability, by the way. Okay. Abacus. 
come here. Attack them. Arcus. Bomb them. Okay. Attack them. All right, looks like we, we took them out pretty easily. Okay, how about this? Switch to your gun. We don't use your gun all that often, but... Objective taken. All right. So there we go, we got that. Hostile movement up ahead, brothers. Hostile movement. We gotta take out this generator. Let's do this. Can we destroy that? Focus fire here. I think we need to go around the other way, unfortunately. I don't think we can get by that stuff. Take them out. Lod, you can go back to your weapon. Get pissed. Take them out, take them out. Okay. Okay. I guess we should take them out. Should we just take these guys out? Oh, you know, we can just go around. That's what we're going to do. Alright, this is what we'll do. Come this way. Cyrus, you need your demo ability. You guys should probably move back. Okay, that wasn't good. Oh, retreat, retreat. Oh, man. Retreat, just retreat. I might lose this. Oh, man. This is going to be really hard to recover from. wasn't very good. We're gonna... Very small chance that we're gonna survive this. This might be my first mission to lose. out somehow. Dang it. Don't know, don't know. I think it might be over, guys. <laughs> this is the worst I've uh, done so far. Try. Let's just one less Eldar to plague us. Purge the alien. Purge the Xenos. Get to that position, brothers. Why? What? Why won't they fight this person? One less Eldar to plague us. Okay. 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 Let's see, what's this? Tactical advance. Okay, so let's just go forward and see if we can heal somebody. Deploying stimulants. Cyrus, here. Cyrus, retreat. Just retreat. Both of you, retreat. Just retreat. Just retreat. We got two people now. Alright. 
It's pretty intense. Not gonna get anything for speed, but that's for sure. Scout squad ready for orders. Okay. Let's try. Got to get Vlad back, cause then he can heal. Okay. Flashbang them. We need to use everything we have. Cyrus, you focus fire. There. Everybody attack them. I'm gonna do a fly stick. Alright, retreat, retreat, retreat. Alright, we got three people up. Man. A hard one. Scout squad ready for orders. Devastator Marines ready for combat. Now you are a devastator, brother. <laughs> now you are a devastator, brother. Reposition. Need to use cover better. Okay. Slowly but surely we're recovering from this nonsense. Tarkus. Maybe attack them. Maybe attack them. Oh, is it, is it? Okay, somebody has a melt bomb, right? melt a bomb Do that there. melt bomb Show me what passes for fury among your misbegotten. Get to that position, brothers. See no targeted. Uh, okay, melt a bomb Do it. Okay. Nice. Okay, gotta get the captain up. Right, now we need to retreat and heal. Man, not doing very good. At least, located. at least I recovered, right? Locked in melee. Where's Cyrus? Get out of here, Cyrus, what are you doing? This was neither the time nor the place. Exactly. Okay. Okay, let's go around. Here, let's go around. They're mean over there. They're meanies. We need to. <laughs> Moving up. You know, take it easy this time. Where's this generator? Can we attack that? Okay. Alright, let's get on strategic interest. Squad eliminated. Okay, so now we gotta get this shrine. If we can. So we can get some a bunch of equipment and stuff here. But this would have been defended. I give up on the time. Uh, Field generators are deploying now, Commander. So I wonder Additional what's over here. Will not be available until your next deployment. I'm a little confused. Oh, there's someone coming. These guys, okay. Hostile movement up ahead, brothers. I think what happened that last time th that made me like really screw up was um I I'm here, why not get this thing? What are these? Ranger squad. Next target. Alright. I guess we should go ahead and take that. 
We're out of grenades, so let's just take this. Exercise your faith in combat. What are these things? War spider group. Creepy. Okay, we're going too far ahead. Let's, let's heal. Charge them. Oh my gosh, okay. Get the insane here. Melt the bombs for the melt the bomb. Do that. Nobody. Okay. We haven't the melt the bomb yet. I think I brought those melted bombs, man. I would not be able to take out those tanks. Alright. Step back. Can you attack this spider guy? Howling Banshee, melee specialist. Eldar Grav Tank, Fire Prism Class. The zombie animals have found me. I cannot let them hinder our cause. Where is this Fire Prism Tank? I can't see it. Lost my only guy. Let's turn off this this orb. He's running out of energy. Ah! In close combat. Let them fall before us. These guys again. Cyrus, I need your specialty. Bomb that. What's that? Melt a bomb. Here. Serious, huh? He's shooting at us. I mean, I keep seeing this big explosion, but I'm not sure where it's from. And it's really deadly. Okay, retreat, guys. Everybody just needs to retreat. Retreat, retreat. Why aren't they retreating? Everybody retreat. Retreat, retreat. Is everybody retreating? Hopefully they are. Okay, good. We need only a word. Man. This one's taking forever. Not that it's a problem, but just wow.
feel like they're getting reinforcements. I'm not really sure how to um, curtail their reinforcements. Maybe they get reinforcements the same way I do, so I need to take these reinforcement centers from them. I know there was a tank over here. Did I get it with a melting bomb? But see, that's what's really annoying me. Is that, is that huge artillery attack that I don't know where it's coming from? Oh, is it that? Let's get over here. After this melting bomb, attack there. Oh, wait, no, that's it. Melting bomb, right there. Alright, 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 alright. Retreat. Everybody needs to retreat. Cyrus is down. Now that we know where we need to go. Everybody retreating? Retreat. Oh. Christ. Excuse me. Shouldn't have said that. Of course. Almost got it. Um, it looks like it's low on energy. Get him to stand up. Okay. Retreat, retreat, retreat. Just retreat. Can you retreat? Vlad, <laughs> no. Not Vlad. <laughs> okay. Charge here. Run away. It's over. Oh man. All right. Dang it. Let this dark day fuel the fires of vengeance. That sucks. Do you still get to keep your equipment? I mean, your um, experience? I wonder. Extraction was successful, Commander. All forces are ready to assault the Eldar position again. Oh, okay. It's pretty cool. All right, what do I... I wonder if I lose any advantages because I... Oh, I guess I still got to keep the Imperial Shrine. Okay. Um, and the Tyranid Invasion went down. So, all right, well, I guess I'll try again in the next episode. That was That was pretty dang hard to be... Uh, completely honest. Um, when that tank started, uh, you know, <laughs> chasing down Vlad, um, it was over. But the problem was, of 3,200 hit points, it was down to 280. So I was really close to blowing up the, the tank. It sucks. Anyhow, thank you very much. Um, that was episode 11, I believe, and have a good day.